lobsters, with their armored bodies and imposing claws, have long captured the human imagination. These fascinating creatures play a vital role in the marine ecosystem. Their life cycle from birth to adulthood is a remarkable journey of survival and adaptation. From tiny transparent larvae to clawed crustaceans, lobsters face numerous challenges. Lobsters are decapod crustaceans with 10 legs, including large claws for defense and capturing prey. They are primarily nocturnal, hunting and scavenging under the cover of darkness. Their hard exoskeleton necessitates a unique growth process involving molting. Found in oceans worldwide, lobsters inhabit a variety of habitats. The life of a lobster begins as a tiny translucent larva, drifting in the vast expanse of the ocean. After hatching from eggs carried by the female lobster for several months, these larvae are at the mercy of ocean currents, facing numerous predators and environmental challenges. Their survival depends on their ability to find food and avoid being eaten by larger marine organisms. As they drift in the plankton, they undergo several molts, shedding their exoskeletons and gradually developing the characteristics of adult lobsters. During the larval stage, lobsters feed on microscopic organisms in the plankton, using their small appendages to filter food from the water. They are constantly molting, shedding their outer shells as they grow larger. This process makes them vulnerable to predators, as they are temporarily soft and defenseless until their new shells harden. As the larvae grow and develop, they gradually become more recognizable as lobsters, developing their characteristic claws and segmented bodies. Molting is a critical process in the lobster's life cycle, allowing for growth and regeneration. As the lobster grows, its hard exoskeleton becomes too small, requiring it to shed the old shell and grow a new one. This process, while essential for development, leaves the lobster vulnerable to predators during the period when its new shell is still soft. The molting process begins with the lobster absorbing calcium from its old shell, softening it and preparing for the shedding process. The lobster then retreats to a safe location, where it begins to separate its body from the old exoskeleton. Once the old shell is shed, the lobster is extremely vulnerable. Its new exoskeleton is soft and pliable, offering little protection from predators. During the molting process, lobsters are also able to regenerate lost limbs. As the lobster progresses through successive molts, it gradually transitions from a juvenile to an adult. This transformation involves not only an increase in size, but also changes in morphology and behavior. With each molt, the juvenile lobster's claws become larger and stronger, enabling it to capture larger prey and defend itself more effectively. Its coloration also changes, becoming darker and more vibrant, providing camouflage in its rocky habitat. The lobster's overall size increases significantly, eventually reaching the size of a marketable adult. Juvenile lobsters are more solitary and less aggressive than adults, often hiding in crevices and under rocks. As they mature, they become more territorial and establish dominance hierarchies, competing for food and mates. The adult lobster, with its fully developed claws and robust exoskeleton, is a formidable predator in its environment. Lobsters play a vital role in the marine ecosystem, acting as both predator and prey. They help to control populations of various invertebrates, such as crabs, mussels, and sea urchins, preventing these species from overgrazing and disrupting the balance of the ecosystem. Their presence ensures the health and diversity of the ocean floor. As a food source, lobsters are an important part of the diet of many larger marine animals, including fish, seals, and sharks. Their presence in the food chain helps to maintain the balance of populations within the ecosystem. Lobsters also contribute to the nutrient cycling within the ecosystem. As they consume organic matter, they break down and release nutrients back into the environment, enriching the seafloor and supporting the growth of other organisms. This process is vital for maintaining the productivity and health of the marine ecosystem. Their burrowing activities create shelters and refugees for other organisms, increasing the complexity and diversity of the seafloor. A lobsters exhibit a range of fascinating behaviors, from complex social interactions to intricate navigation strategies. Their social interactions involve dominance hierarchies, territorial disputes, and elaborate courtship rituals. These behaviors contribute to the dynamics of lobster populations and the overall structure of their communities. 
lobsters are known for their ability to navigate their environment using a combination of chemical cues and visual landmarks. They can detect subtle changes in water currents and chemical gradients, allowing them to locate food mates and suitable shelter. This remarkable navigational ability enables them to thrive in the complex and ever-changing ocean environment. One of the most intriguing aspects of lobster behavior is their molting process. This vulnerable period requires careful planning and execution, as the lobster must find a safe location to shed its old shell and remain hidden until its new shell hardens. Another fascinating aspect of lobster behavior is their ability to regenerate lost limbs. The lobster fishery is vital for many coastal regions, providing livelihoods for countless families. However, overfishing raises concerns about lobster sustainability. Balancing economic benefits with conservation is a crucial challenge. Sustainable practices ensure the long-term health of lobster populations. These include size limits, catch quotas, and minimizing habitat damage. Careful management is essential for a productive fishery. Marine protected areas help safeguard lobster populations. A lobsters are a prized delicacy, renowned for their succulent meat and rich flavor. From simple boiled lobster to elaborate lobster thermidor, lobster dishes grace the menus of fine dining establishments and family kitchens alike. Their culinary versatility has made them a sought-after ingredient in cuisines around the world. The preparation of lobster requires careful handling and attention to detail. Whether steamed, grilled, or baked, lobster meat is best enjoyed fresh and cooked to perfection. The delicate flavor of the meat can be enhanced with a variety of seasonings and sauces, from simple butter and lemon to complex herb and spice blends. Lobster is a versatile ingredient that can be incorporated into a wide range of dishes, from appetizers and salads to main courses and pasta dishes. The culinary appeal of lobster has contributed to its economic importance, driving demand and supporting the lobster fishing industry. Conservation efforts are crucial for ensuring the long-term survival of lobster populations and the health of the marine ecosystem. These efforts involve a combination of research, monitoring, and management strategies aimed at protecting lobster habitats and regulating fishing practices. The goal is to maintain a healthy and sustainable lobster population for future generations. Marine protected areas play a vital role in lobster conservation, providing safe havens for lobsters to reproduce and thrive without the pressures of fishing. These protected areas also help to preserve the biodiversity and ecological integrity of the marine environment. Sustainable fishing practices such as size limits, catch quotas, and the use of gear that minimizes bycatch and habitat damage are essential for maintaining healthy lobster populations. These practices help to ensure that lobsters are harvested responsibly, allowing populations to replenish and thrive. Public awareness and education are crucial for fostering a sense of responsibility and stewardship for the marine environment and lobster populations. Lobsters have long held a place in human culture, appearing in mythology, folklore, and art across various societies. From ancient legends to modern literature, lobsters have been depicted as symbols of strength, resilience, and the mysteries of the deep. In some cultures, lobsters are associated with the sea gods and goddesses, representing the power and abundance of the ocean. Their hard exoskeletons and imposing claws have made them symbols of protection and defense. Lobsters have also been featured in culinary traditions for centuries, symbolizing feasts and celebrations. The lobster's presence in mythology and folklore reflects its enduring fascination and cultural significance. These cultural representations underscore the lobster's importance in human history and its connection to the natural world. From its perilous beginnings as a tiny larva to its transformation into a formidable predator, the lobster's life cycle is a testament to its resilience and adaptability. Its role in the marine ecosystem, its culinary significance, and its presence in human culture underscore its enduring allure. As we continue to explore the mysteries of the ocean, the lobster remains a captivating subject of study, offering insights into the complex web of life beneath the waves. Its remarkable journey from birth to adulthood reminds us of the interconnectedness of all living things and the importance of conserving our marine resources. The lobster's enduring fascination lies in its unique biology, its ecological importance, and its cultural significance. Protecting lobster populations and their habitats is crucial for maintaining the health and balance of the marine ecosystem. 
By understanding the lobster's life cycle and its role in the ocean, we can appreciate its importance and work towards its conservation for future generations.